everybody. Cause here, out on a beautiful Saturday. Temperature is probably 45 degrees. It's a little bit chilly, but uh, compared to uh, yesterday, it's uh, like night and day. Uh, Thursday, temperature is like up in the 60s. Uh, clear skies just like that. And then by oh, 6 that evening, the temperatures uh, must have dropped like 20 degrees. Uh, and by uh, midnight, it was supposed to like sleet and, and snow uh, later on Friday. So it was just crazy. Like I said, 60s to uh, the very low 20s. Actually, I think it got into the teens uh, that night. But um, yeah, Friday was just crazy. It was like in the 20s, 30s at the high. And then uh, today, I think it might get up to the 50s, but as you can see, uh, there's no uh, snow on the ground, no sleet, no ice, uh, beautiful clear skies, and a beautiful day to ride. I think the uh, wind's supposed to pick up tomorrow. It's crazy Texas weather. But, uh, hey, at least I get to ride year round. Not to rub it in for you guys out there. Well, today, instead of, uh, today, what I should be doing is uh, getting my hair cut. I actually should have got my hair cut uh, probably a week, maybe uh, two weeks ago. I should have got my hair cut about, you know, two weeks ago. You know, it's really shaggy and everything like that. Person just stopped right in the middle of the intersection for no reason. Anyway. And, uh, I just don't, uh, it's for some funny reason, I just don't like getting my hair cut. Never, I, it goes, it goes all the way back to when, uh, I was a young kid and always got my hair cut at the PX. My dad would, uh, take me down to the PX, he'd get his haircut, I'd get my haircut, and uh, I guess probably it was a hairstyle too, you know, it was just the comb to the right, not uh, the old standard uh, 60s cut, I guess it is. Uh, clean cut, I should say. That's why I guess when I uh, was allowed to make my own choice, I uh, let my hair grow out. You know. And uh, get it styled and everything like that. But uh, even then, I really didn't get my uh, hair cut in a timely manner. It was always when um, 
it would uh, actually start bugging me where the especially uh, my bangs uh, if they started get falling in my eyes which they're kind of doing right now uh, I uh, that's when I would finally okay I had enough had to, have to go get my hair cut so So I'm kind of at that point right now, but not not exactly, because here I am on on the bike riding. Woo! Bump, bump, bump. Right and get my uh, fix in. So it's kind of funny. Don't know, well, again, here I am, 61 years old, and still still feeling the same thing as I was uh, five or six, not liking my haircut. <laughs> I don't know if I'll ever uh, get that thing uh, to... Uh, to change on me and uh, which uh, kind of leads oh woo. Just like that I guess uh, kind of leads me into uh, my other things is uh, procrastination you know, I don't consider myself a procrastinator. I mean, when I put my mind something to uh, to get something done, I generally uh, get it done. And uh, you know, I just don't like uh, seeing things undone. But uh, here lately, I don't know what it is. Maybe uh, something to do with the heart attack I had back in July. I don't know, but uh, yeah, it's not about everything. You know, it's just uh, certain things that uh, I choose to procrastinate on. You know, I'll, I'll wait to the, not the very, well, in some cases I could, it could be the uh, last minute, but, uh, you know, definitely, it uh, takes a while to the point where I said, okay, I better get, get to it. You know, I've got the, uh, Kind of a uh, recessed lighting that uh, I need to go fix. I think that we got, I got a loose wire up there, and all I gotta do is you know just go up in the attic, open up the junction box. I kind of know which light it is because that's the only one that actually turns on. So it's not very difficult to trace down. But, uh, you know, since uh, we've got other lights, it's kind of like, okay, well, this will work. And uh, <laughs> so, uh, instead of up there in the attic uh, working on that light, here I am, out on the bike. And, uh, you know, there's other things around the house, you know. <laughs> that, uh, you know, I kind of wait on, but, you know, some things you kind of have to do right away. Uh, like last weekend, uh, the, uh, the toilet, the floaty thing inside started not, uh, working right. It would, like, get stuck or something, and 
wouldn't fill up the tank. Well, that situation kind of becomes important now, and I, I shouldn't waste any time to get that thing fixed. What are we doing here? Okay, let me go, let me go, let me go. So yeah, I took care of that right away. Went, got to Home Depot, got that, got that thing fixed in about half hour. Because that was a must do. But, uh, uh, taxes is another thing. I normally uh, do the taxes like right away as soon as I can. You know, as soon as you get your uh, W-2s and everything, there I'm there you know, doing it myself, trying to take care of it. But uh, <laughs> here it is, March and. Yeah, I keep on uh, looking at the uh, the stuff. Going ah, okay, I'll take care of it. So yeah, yeah, I know. Yeah, well, you're letting the government keep all this stuff. I said, yeah, I know that. I know the I know the arguments. Because normally the only time I actually would wait. Was, uh, was when I actually owed them. And, oh, talk about waiting there. Talk about procrastinating there. I actually waited to uh, the 15th and had to do the, uh, what I call the midnight run to the post office, you know, where they're outside, just drive by and drop off their uh, taxes at that time. Had to do that a couple of times, but, uh, that's really no fun. Not that uh, paying taxes is fun in any way. But anyway. But, I don't know. It seems like I progress, procrastinate a little bit more nowadays. I don't know if that's an age thing. Or what. What's that saying? Uh, why do something today if you can't push push it off till tomorrow? Something like that? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Like I said, I, I never used to uh, be that way. I mean, not not. I'm sure we all procrastinate a little bit, but uh, you know, definitely, I, I think I I do that more often now. And again, it only depends on what it is. Uh, so, anyway, what do you guys think? Are you guys procrastinators too? Are you one of those that uh, has to get it done right away, no matter what it is? So, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up subscribe hit the notification button for new videos I put out new videos uh, Wednesdays and Thursdays uh, Wednesdays and Saturdays at 9 o'clock although I'm thinking about maybe pushing it out a little bit later uh, again procrastinating <laughs> uh, I don't know 9 o'clock seems early uh, for everybody, because uh, that's what, 7 o'clock West Coast? So maybe I'll push it out till 10, maybe noon? I don't know. Yeah, I think about that one. But anyway, maybe uh, Wednesdays and Saturdays for sure. And uh, keep them short. 
sweet. Give you a ride while I'm out riding. So, as always, be safe. Peace out. Cars out.